good afternoon students today i am going to revise again the same topic physical properties of metal and known metal i am going to share a video with you all please watch the video very carefully last year all metals in the pure state have a shining surface this property is called metallic luster non metals on the other hand are dull therefore they do not have luster hardness try to cut iron with knife isn't it very difficult why because metals are hard now try to cut a rubber with knife it must be very easy thus non metals are soft malleability let's perform an activity take iron nail coal piece piece of thick aluminum wire pencil lid beat each of them with a hammer what do you observe iron nail and aluminum wire change their shape but coal piece and pencil lead break into pieces harder we beat greater is the change of shape thus metals if beaten change their shape and forms thin sheet on beating this property is called malleability non metals break into pieces like we have seen in activity ductility another interesting property of metals is the ability to form thin wires it is called ductility with this property you can see wires of aluminum copper iron non metals do not show this property and breaks if we try to form wires sonority the property of producing ringing sound when a substance is struck by a hard substance is called sonority metals are sonorous but non metals are not conduction of heat if one end of iron rod is heated then we can feel rise in temperature at other end also this means that metals conduct heat non metals does not conduct heat if non metals would have been conducting heat will it be possible to use them as handles for cookers and pans no conduction of electricity let's perform another activity connect circuit as shown check if the bulb lights or not repeat the same for other materials observation material and conductivity iron nail is good conductor sulfur is bad conductor coal piece is bad conductor copper wire is good conductor from this activity you can verify that metals are good conductor of electricity but non metals are bad conductor of electricity exceptions sodium and potassium are soft and can be easily cleaved that is cut to form plain surface by knife however these belongs to metals similarly all metals are solid except mercury which exist in liquid form iodine is a non metal but it is lustrous diamond 
is hardest substance which is a non metal what this means is that we cannot classify substance as metals or non metals only on their physical properties to classify we have to study their chemical properties as well we will learn about them in upcoming videos so this was our video regarding physical difference between metal and non metal i advise all the students to go through this video uh, okay students thank you and have a good day thanks for